he had to go to court. He had to be a witness. Guess what? The system failed him. Because DJ was- Ben 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 Dan. Oh man! Oh damn! Listen, before we go any further, listen. Shouts out to the whole Bandana fam. Shout out to everybody that's tied in with DJ Bandana Black. Make sure you go ahead right now and subscribe to the channel. Make sure you like the video. But we got to talk about this today, Mister Bosco One Hundred, Mister Bick and Back being boo. Listen. I just want to say this, first of all, uh, before we even get into the rest of this video, I want to say this. In my opinion, my theory, my own opinion, I believe there's a difference between snitching and telling. And just real quick to give you my synapses on that. I don't know if that's the right word. I've been trying to use a lot of big words and all that. But anyways, to give you my opinion on that, I think telling... Um, Telling is okay. Snitching is not. And I'm going to explain it to you. Now, before you start saying, yo, you support snitching, because a lot of y'all just listen to the first five seconds of something and comment. Listen, you got to listen to the whole thing. The reason why I say it's okay, check this, right? Say you and your man uh, see an op and y'all spray the whole block up. Y'all hit some lady across the street. Y'all hit some little kid or something like that. And then y'all get away. But Miss Johnson across the street took down your license plate number, knew who you was, and went straight to the authorities, and she told on you. Now, that's telling. That's okay, because she was not committed a crime. She's an upstanding uh, citizen. She's not She's not partaking in any crime. That's what you're supposed to do. As a regular citizen, you're supposed to call the police, call 911, whatever else like that. Now, snitching is different. Now, say you and your man, in that same scenario, uh, get away, but the police chase y'all, your man hop out, he get caught, but you keep going. And then 30 minutes later, the police at your door because your man told on you, you're like, man, shit, they caught me, they coming to get you, and your man telling you. Now, that's snitching. That telling is snitching. That's snitching, and that's wrong because y'all both were committing a crime. He got caught and told on you, so that's snitching. Me, either way, I don't think I can actually tell or snitch. Either way, it's just the way I was brought up. City, I was brought up, neighborhood, different stuff like that. I know I'm part of the problem, too. I'm probably part of the problem, too, by saying that, but I just couldn't bring myself to tell. I, I just couldn't do it. But anyways, Bosco 100, <laughs> Mr. Calling Everybody a Star. And this is the reason why this is funny. This is the reason why the internet is really going crazy with this, because... um I can see, uh, apparently this happened when Bosco 100 was 12 years old. When he was about 12 years old, I guess he witnessed a murder. And not only did he tell about the murder, he went to court, testified, and pointed out the person in court. So basically, he, he did the whole thing at 12 years old. Now, if he would have did that and continued on his life just being an upstanding citizen, you know, finished school, wasn't all this Queen Street, Queen Street, you, you, you're a star boy, you're a star boy. I mean, he caught everybody a snitch. Now, if he wouldn't have continued on life doing that, we probably wouldn't have had a problem with it. But because he puts on this, um, what do I say? And I'm not even saying put on because he, he might be, he might have did that then. I mean, you're 12 years old, you're a little bit different. I'm not making an excuse for him because I think it's wrong either way. But, I mean, he might, what he's talking about now, he, that might really be the real him. But that doesn't erase the fact that what you did at 12, and especially how hard you be going on on everybody else who told or snitched. So I'm going to show you all the rest of the snippet of this video. Y'all let me know. Let me know in the comments. Is, is this technically snitching? I mean, even though he was 12 years old, I mean, he was traumatized. This might have been before he jumped in the streets. Me personally, I think Bosco 100 is, is, is type slow, though. Um, just You'll see this one part of the clip where his eyes just roll kind of weird. He's like doing little hand signals. So he's just acting real, real weird. I think he types slow. Like not being funny, I think he's like something something really wrong with him. But anyways, let me know in the comments, is this is this snitching? Do y'all still count this as snitching even though he was 12 years old? Or are you the type of person where you don't care whether it's telling or snitching? If Miss Johnson witnessed a crime, she tell the police, she a snitch too and snitches get stitches. Is that how you rocking? Is that how y'all rolling where y'all from? Well, let me know in the comments. Make sure you hit me up online, uh, Snapchat. At Twitter, Instagram, at DJ Bandana Black. And please make sure you subscribe to the channel. We're trying to grow. We're trying to grow. Keep it locked. It's DJ Bandana Black. Mr. Well Connected, even more respected. I'm out. He witnessed a murder. Walking out your door, your neighbor get murdered in front of a 12 year old boy. That was traumatizing. He had to go to court. He had to be a witness. Guess what? The system failed him because we didn't do the right things to get him the help that he needed. Then he's hanging around with people that you're pretending to be your friend. Everyone that you think are there supporting your family aren't there to support your family. They're there to take advantage of your family. When you put your children in juvenile hall, they don't learn to be good in there. They learn to be bad. They meet other children that come from bad household that might not have the upbringing that he's had. Yeah, there's a lot of fighting going on in juvenile hall. Exactly. DJ Ben 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 Dan.